M0 FXP Digital Ham Radio Diary. Welcome. Okay, well, just setting up the radio for FTA, and uh, uh, this is this radio has got the 1.4 version firmware, so it's the newest version with all the scroll features. So I'll just take you through my uh, menu settings. So you go menu set. I I've, I've tried the preset one, but it it doesn't work for me. So I'm just going to show you my my settings. So we'll go to connectors first. Start at the top. AF fifty off off fifty fifty fifty. Then data off mode is USB. Data mod is USB. I haven't touched any of this. C USB is CIV, so I haven't touched any of this from the from re resetting the radio. Uh, I'll just go to the CIV section. So board rate is auto. CIV address ninety four point H. CIV transceive on. Remote transceive zero zero H. CIV output for antenna off. CIV USB port link to remote. I'll just go back through them slowly. The 94H thing I think is important and the auto is what works for me. Um, so that's pretty much everything, isn't it? I've set the power at the moment to 15 watts. Made sure the antenna's tuned. And so let's, uh, well, I, know, I know it is working on the computer. So I'll just show you before we do switch to the computer that you were... Uh, you do need to sort of make sure that when you're in transmit mode, I'll just put it on transmit now. Well, I'll select tune on the rate on the WJTS TX software and see the way it's tuned. And now look at the sort of out here. You need to get the out so that the you only get like one bar. So if I move the power on the FTA up a bit. See the way you've got about seven bars? So I'll go down a bit and I'll, I'll show you doing it um, in a sec anyway. But just to sh let you know that when you're in the right position, see that you've just got one little blue one showing there. And it's not a great um, to see. I'll just try and tune in. I've got too much glare here. So there's blue. See the little blue here? You, don't, you basically don't want the ALC too high. So, uh, right, let's go to the computer.